Pony Booth Expo 2017, looking at some of the cool things that brought me over to the Czech Cherry Booth, and I've got Ross here. Ross, you've got something you're excited to tell us about, and, and we're just going to tell the world all at the same time. It's going to be awesome. Yes, I am incredibly excited. We're actually unveiling it publicly here, so let me give you a little backstory on it. We developed an online booking platform that would be smarter for DJs and for photo booths. For me, I found that I came into work one day, and before you know it, I spent the entire day on paperwork. I didn't get to do any of my DJ stuff, and I said, what the heck? I didn't start doing this to send out contracts and invoices and to do all this every single day. I want to go mix. I want to be a DJ. Right. And so I was like, there's got to be a better solution. I hopped on there. I've tried everything. And there's some good stuff out there. I made the glue work. I connected a bunch of stuff. But as we got bigger and bigger, I was like, we're spending so much time on busy work and not productive work that there's got to be a better way. There wasn't. So I hired this good guy. He actually built out a custom platform for us. We launched it and it worked so well for our company in Southern California that we wanted to open it up to the world. So we took the next 10 months, we recoded the whole thing to make it like a Squarespace that anyone could edit it and we relaunched it. We did a soft launch, we put about two dozen companies on it right from the start to try it out, have fun with it, kick the tires. And now we're here at the Photo Booth Expo unleashing it to the world. Hello. So the cool part, we're going to show you the, the, uh, the actual photo booth side of it. And there's one cool feature on the DJ that I have to show you that's different from the photo booth. Cool. Let's take a look. So number one, they can go on here and they can book online directly. When they do it, they can see all your packages and event types directly on the site. Phenomenal for photo booths. Pricing is already pretty much transparent across the industry with it. So they can put in their event details. As they're doing this, it's actually generating them a reservation and an account right on the spot. What's cool is if you have five booths, it actually has an overbook feature built in too. So it won't allow for that. It actually has smart software built in. But it's like Amazon. So if they actually update the number of hours, it live updates the cart as well. Nice. As they press continue, they're choosing their photo booth background. Everything about this is fully customizable as well. Same with their custom graphic, what's their event details. So it's just asking some basic form stuff. But as it's doing this, it's actually creating the reservation and creating the actual reservation and contract for them. So you have add-ons that are specific to the event type. And our final window here, they're ready to check out. If it's a school and we all know that they never pay with a credit card, <laughs> they can also do that too. But if you want, contract is already built in. They click the button here to agree, pops up, collects the card. It works through Stripe, has a great API. So it doesn't require extra login windows like PayPal or anything like that. Now they have an account with you and your company. So now Local Boy, they have an account with us. Jamie now can manage her entire event online, no problem. She can go in here and add stuff, she can make a payment, she can add and remove add-ons anytime. Automatic emails get sent out to both Jamie and me, letting me know if there's a new reservation that came in. She has full access to all of it under the hood. And as well as invoices, you never have to make an invoice again. It makes invoices for you. So the invoices are automatically generated, but let's say Jamie wants to make an event change. So Jamie pops back, says, hey, my event's not five hours, it's six hours. She presses save, updates the balance, it automatically updates the invoice, and it automatically sends out the email for you. So it does a lot of those tedious busy work already under the hood. Important documents like your W-9, your worker's comp, they're already built into the account as well. Now we gotta pause. That's the client side of it. Let's switch over to the actual boss side of it, the employees or the, the person running it. They have their own login as well, and so are their employees. When they log in, you're gonna get a little something different here. It'll pop up, you get a nice overview of everything going on with your company. So you have a nice dashboard, recent payments. Here's the crazy part. This is live from our site. I'm over here in Las Vegas. I'm getting payments for all my stuff without lifting a finger. It's insane. I didn't build the platform to do that, but people just seem to love the on-demand option. Incomplete signups, it logs all that. All of your upcoming events are all in here as well. If we go down a little bit here, you'll see your recent events and everything is all on display. Of course, it has iCal support. It has everything you need to make sure you can manage your reservations. You can manage everything that you want, from packages to user accounts to add-ons, even to the backgrounds that display on the forms. Let's do a photo booth one real quick, though. As it pops up right here, we can actually go under the hood and we can make a photo booth package. So when they click through, it'll ask some basic details of preference of what do you want to say, what's your starting rate for it, what's your hourly rate, what's your increments. So you're setting these for the booking engine. Down here will be your deposit, so you can ask what you want to require. And then your plan description is right there as well. So they save it. Now let's move on to some user accounts. You can set user accounts as well as employees. You can assign them to events and easily that employee can manage the entire event. Not only that, but they can communicate directly through the app. So right here on the messaging, they can send out an email to them. What's great about it is they don't have to log in every time. If they're on Gmail and they just reply, it automatically keeps the thread going. Nice. So it doesn't require any extra steps. It's all just one spot. The whole thing was built to reduce busy work, create a better experience for customers and make sure that both employees and everyone are on the same page. Sure. Um, with this too, Get into our final step here. Incomplete signups too, it logs all of them. So every time they put in some details, if they don't complete a reservation, it keeps track of all that as well. So follow-ups are a breeze. You have repar ready to go. 
when you hop on here, it gives you a nice start guide on how to get set up. I can have it on someone's site in less than 20 minutes. It doesn't take much time. It integrates onto your existing website already, which is great about it. And of course, there you have it, Check Cherry. Very nice. Wow, that's, that's, that's awesome. That's fast, right? That was very quick and very, you did a great job with that. You ready for but the DJ? I, I, you yeah, know what, you, you, when ahead. you mentioned the DJ part of it, I got really distracted. And I uh -huh. mean, you had said something about photo booths, but you know, I heard the DJ. You want to come over here and see the DJ? One let's, let's, go, let's go wander, wander over here and Can we're going to show, the, let's check that out. So this platform has two sides of it. Number one, it works for DJs and photo booths. It also works with any service professional. But this is our website here and they can choose their event types. Let's say you have a wedding coming up. We know that some event types are kind of repeat business. Like certain wedding packages are just a set price. Yep. Certain private parties or corporate ones are this price. And then of course we have our custom events. So there's both sides of it. This is designed right here for someone who's ready to book, happy with it. She goes, hey, I like your gold package. Okay, cool. So we put in some details here. See the background is different, so it's custom for that. So I say, hello, my name is Ross. Here's my quick phone number. This is where the engine's incredibly smart. So when they go in here and you put your date in, if you press continue here, it will only display which DJs at your company are available. Even a step forward, our Wi-Fi is a little slow here, but even a step forward with Chris, we can bring him up and you can view his bio video, you can get to know Chris a little bit more. So it's pretty awesome. It's a nice self-serve option if they want it. A customer can 100% still do your normal sales routine. If you want to bring them for a meeting, do so. This is a great way to just kind of put it all together and make it in one location. But when you're happy with Chris, that's good. Let's go back though. Me, I'm personally booked up on May 19th, pretty much to capacity. So if I choose that date and hit continue, you're gonna get different DJs that pop up. It only displays what DJs are available, and even a step forward, you choose preferences on them. So if a DJ only does private parties, or you have a guy who does weddings, or a guy who does bigger schools, you choose those settings, and they'll only show up in the booking engine under that. It's very important, because a big guy like you who does big events, you don't wanna get tied up with a smaller event when you need it for larger stuff. Yep. So you can choose what preferences you show up under the hood. Everything on here is really cool. Let's show you the pricing real quick, because that's always important. So once they found the availability, sure. they found a DJ. They're like, "Yep." Can how? What's the next step? What do they? What do they continue beyond that point? Oh yeah. So right here, it's just right here on the site. Same thing. They just go click through. I can reserve an event right now with you. So we can just do one, two, three. Put in some fun test info in here. My receptionist loves me this week because I keep putting through test info. As we keep going here, these are the add-ons I built for the DJ one. So on top you have your recommended ones, and then down here you have additional equipment that they a lot of times request. And then down here would be like your atmospheric effects. So I'm right. like, oh, hey, you know what? Or even like a cool add on like these glow things. I'm like, hey, I want 20 of these. So you just click add. It adds it to the account right there, puts it right on there, and it just adds it to their cart. They can go back anytime, but we're already on the last step. Right here is your final step. They say, hey, I'm happy with this. Let's go ahead and sign up with a check. So that way we don't gotta put in a deposit right now. Once you do so, because I'm already logged in, it has a slightly different window. Yeah. It allows you to either create a new account or add it to an existing account. Okay. So that way it can be under there. But as soon as you click assign to event, right there it pops up, it puts it in there. If I open my phone and I click it, I'm gonna get that email notification that a new event just came in. So if I go in here and you let me, oh sorry, it. I can't show the password, one second. I was gonna say, you may not have much internet here. This has been a tough, I know. tough building. We've been having fun with it. We're making it work. So guys, if we log in right now, here's that new book that just came in at 418. So it sends out the emails right away. It sends to whatever DJ they selected as well. So Elise has the email too. And now it shows up under her event types also. So that's, it's really that simple. Wow. <laughs> Easy as ordering a pizza, folks. And you talked about pricing. Sure, yep. I'm gonna bring that up here for you. So right now, anybody, the platform is fully available. Just visit checkcherry.com. We offer a free 30-day trial. Are we ready for, how much do we think it's gonna cost? Do you have any ballpark idea? You know the industry a little bit. I do, and that's why I'm not gonna say anything. <laughs> You're just much. holding your tongue? I'm going Okay, to. so here we go. So the platform itself, there's three plans. It really only matters how many actual user accounts you have. You can do unlimited everything else. There's nothing holding you back from unlimited clients, unlimited bookings, unlimited reservations. The only thing that matters is the number of team members. Ready for it? 19 bucks a month. Starting at 19. 19 dollars a month. Cancel at any time. Free 30-day trial. We're giving out a 50 dollars credit for anyone who signs up here at this convention, which buys them three and a half months of free. We will do a free white glove service and put it on your site for you. 
So it's included as well. So if you're familiar with HTML code, that's what they could put, you, they'd be putting on their site if they did it themselves. Yep, they'll be putting some HTML codes. They also have easy book links. It actually is built in here as well. If you go to any package type you want, you just right click and it gives you the embedded HTML code as well as customizing for it. So very easy to implement with their WordPress sites if they're using WordPress. Incredibly easy with WordPress. It'll work with any existing website. It was built to work with other websites. So it gives you a manage, uh, manage reservation side and then you also have your marketing side for your website too. Very cool, very cool. The uh, website where they can check this out was? Checkcherry.com, folks. We'd love for you guys to check it out. Got check. you guys covered. For the photo booth, for the DJ industry, you guys need to check it out. We'll put a link in the description below. And, and yeah, great stuff, Russ. I appreciate Thank it. You Thank much, you much. Thank you so much. What a great run through. We're at Photo Booth Expo 2017.